formaldehyde, aluminum, ethyl mercury. Do vaccines contain ingredients that are untested? Welcome to Plot Twist. Let's dive in. Formaldehyde is naturally made by our own bodies at levels much higher than what's in a vaccine. Aluminum, you get more from food and water daily than from any shot. And the form of mercury, ethyl mercury, used by some vaccines to protect them from degrading, doesn't accumulate in the body. Very different than the type of mercury, methyl mercury, found in some fish which can harm you if consumed in large quantities. Could too many vaccines at once be dangerous? Babies get a lot of vaccines early on, and it could be concerning for parents. But here's what you need to know. Babies fight a thousands of germs daily, from air, food, hands, playing, and even kisses. Oh, you're so cute as you are. Vaccines are a tiny fraction of what every kid around the world is exposed to every day. And vaccines are extremely safe by including the smallest bits needed to train the immune system to fight deadly germs. However, skipping vaccines means being completely unprotected when facing attacks from diseases like measles, whooping cough, rubella, and more. You may ask if diseases like measles and polio are uncommon in my community, why vaccinate? The answer, because vaccines are the very thing that made them uncommon. If we stop vaccinating, they'll come back. As a parent, you make so many choices to protect your child, and vaccines is one of the best choices you can make. More than 150 million lives in the last 50 years have been saved thanks to vaccines. So here's a plot twist, vaccines work, and science backs it up.